Hello everybody, my name is Oltek, aka Peter H. And welcome to Warcraft 3 Reign of Chaos. Now, originally I had planned to record the entire Warcraft series, starting off with Warcraft 1 Orcs and Humans, which is a very old game. And I have I actually got the game and got it on a dust box and I could start the game but I couldn't figure out how to record it so I will wait with that game for another time a whole other time uh, this second one same deal I got a PC uh, not a PC I got a PC yes but I got a CD that's what I meant to say uh, with the game on and I installed it and all of that and I could play the game but I couldn't figure out how to record it so it will have to wait for another time but right now we're going back to the one I played in my childhood Warcraft 3 Reign of Chaos and we're gonna go straight into the single player I'm called Palamusen we'll change that to yeah, I already got one that's called Peter but We'll be taking this Otec and going into the campaign. So, first off, to get the f full thing uh, with us, we'll go and take out the prologue first. Here, we will start off. Um, what? Okay, am I still recording? Well, screw that shit. I couldn't see the video. And when I had fraps on while, while trying to watch the cinematic video, it crashed for some reason. I do not know why, but it did. And I couldn't do anything about it. But here we are, a sprawl. Kind of nightmare was that? And a bird. It was not a nightmare, young war chief, but a vision. Follow me, and I will reveal what your future holds. I believe I remember I the cinematic though. All about, but I'll play along. As I said, I believe I remember the cinematic Let's anyways. The cinematic mm. was about that this done. war that had been going it's on for so done. long. However, the orc encampment is, is still far off. Very good. Uh, this narrator is going to, to be annoying. In Notice this. how the black area shrinks as Thrall moves through it. This it's going to be a little annoying because I can't talk. Select Thrall and order him to move to the banner in stop. the middle of the encampment. Lotar, my warriors, we are yours to command, Restless. war chief. Now that your troops are prepare ready. yourselves. I said your time head. has come to order Thrall's forces to defeat this I am creature. The Select all of your troops for honor. This was only a scout, but the Knoll's camp lies just ahead. Order your troops to perform an aggressive attack move into the enemy encampment. To do this, select all of your troops, click the attack button, and then left click on the ground in the middle of the Knoll camp. We don't need to do that. But okay, we'll do it. Okay, so what I was about to say was, I remember the cinematic anyways, which was about yes. this conflict that had mm. been going on for so many for years, honor. and it was mm. about when this Warcraft 1 actually for started. Honor, Chief, we've discovered a group of Murloc raiders in the nearby river. Can I talk for a second? Make excellent targets for your new chain lightning spell. To have Thrall use his new ability, Click on the chain lightning button and then left click on one of the murlocs. I suppose not. 
Game is very, a little loud though for my talking. Some monsters drop I think, treasure when they are defeated. Maybe not. Chests hold powerful magic items that can only be picked up by heroes such as Thrall. Wait, what? Oh damn, he dropped something. Yeah. Ah, then I get some time. It was about the start of Warcraft One, mm. which was the for orcs. This particular treasure chest. Ah, oh, damn it. Mana. Notice that the potion now occupies one of Thrall's inventory slots near the bottom middle of your screen. Potions of mana can be used to replenish oh, a hero's phone. mana. Phone. The magic energies that allow the casting of spells such as chain lightning. Yes. Dabu. Okay. So we're going there. The wolf howl signifies that night has begun. Be wary, my warriors. Don't let nightfall dull your senses. What wolf howl? Dabu. There's no yes. wolf howl. Well, for honor. potion of healing. Hmm. Yes. <sighs> well, the start of Warcraft yes. One was Dabu. when hmm. the orcs entered Dabu. the dark portal. Yes, an ogre. We'd have a fierce battle on our hands if the beast weren't sleeping. Which, if you are playing World of Warcraft, which you, if you were playing World of Warcraft around uh, the Burning Crusade when Dabu. that was out. For honor. You would uh, be playing um, yes. a dungeon Dabu. where you get to see mm. how the Dark Portal or the Black Portal. For I honor. don't know what's it, what it's really mm. called. The Dark or the Black Portal. For honor. When that was opened mm. by Medivh himself. Yes. And then he let all of brother. the... Those creatures do not sleep at night. When Medivh led all of the orcs into Azeroth from yes. uh, Draenor, or Outland, as you, you might know it as, maybe, or maybe not, because now, um, what is For the expansion honor. called, actually? Warlords of Draenor, yeah, that's out now, so Dabu. now you may know it as Draenor. Your time has come. So, maybe, yeah. For honor. Okay, mm. next chest. Ring of protection. Yes. That's nice. Excellent. Thrall has found a magic ring. Rings are very useful because they provide a constant passive benefit as long as they are carried. Hmm. Dabu. Yeah, but now mm. Medivh seems to have changed Dabu. his mind about being mm. evil, apparently. Dabu. Because he was this mm. big evil Forest sorcerer Forest. or something. I still can't believe they were ever a part of the Horde. That tried to destroy the world and... Yeah. But now he's apparently leading Thrall to no, no. new places. Or to Kalimdor to be more exact. Your time has come. But yeah. The cinematic was. I, did I actually For mention honor. that? The cinematic was about the war. So yes. the c Very cinematic good. pretty that much. That treasure chest held contained a magic tome that can be used <sighs> to give Thrall a permanent benefit. It contained uh, a picture of this human footman. Mm. Which was uh, standing ready for war, uh, and that's Dabu. completing the quest. Standing ready for war, and um, he. What am I trying to say? He was readying himself uh, with an army behind him of uh, humans, while there was an army of orcs coming towards them. So, mm. the orcs and humans are still at war, but. Uh, for honor. Now some orcs. Yeah led by Thrall, are heading over to Kalimdor to take Kalimdor. Greetings, son of Duratan. Well, I knew you That's what we're going to hear about now. It was you I saw in the vision. Who are you? How do you know me? I know many things, young war chief, about you and your people. My identity at this time is unimportant. What is important? is that you rally your people and leave these shores immediately. Leave? What's this all about, human? Human? <laughs> I left my humanity behind long ago. I am something different now. Know that I have seen the future and beheld the great burning shadow that is coming to consume this world. 
you sense it as well, don't you? The demons are returning. Yes, and only by leading your people across the sea to the distant lands of Kalimdor will you have a chance to stand against them. But how could we- I will answer all of your questions in time, young war chief. For now, rally your warriors and prepare to leave this land. We will speak again. Actually, none of this makes oh, sense. Never mind. But the spirits tell me that I should trust him. Actually, where is where is Medivh at the moment in um, in World of Warcraft? I don't know. Well, anyways, that was that one. I guess we'll just take both of these missions because they are they are the prologue and that's just intro stuff. It's been three days and this prophet has yet to show himself. I hope I'm not making a huge mistake by trusting him. War Chief, the clans are assembling as you ordered, but it will take them some time to reach us. Then we must prepare this camp immediately. I want my warriors to have food and proper lodgings when they arrive. Yes, War Chief. Warrior, has there been any word from Grom Hellscream? He and the Warsong clan were supposed to have been here by now. No, War Chief. We haven't heard from Hellscream in some time. Damn it, Grom. Where the hell are you? A peon. Yes. The blinking button at the top of the screen indicates that your quest journal has been updated. Oh, this. To find out oh, more this about one. your objectives. Click on the quest button. Okay. So we are waiting. Once for a peon has been ordered to harvest gold, Rum Hill screen. You will automatically travel back and forth between the gold mine and your closest great hall. Here are a few additional peons to increase the rate of gold. Uh, thank you. The amount of gold that you currently possess is displayed in the upper right portion of your screen. How many will we need As to keep this return going? return to your great hall with gold, your gold stockpile increases. Training a unit takes time. Some when of them are moving faster selected, than others. Like you can this see one. A progress indicator in the bottom He's moving a little faster than screen. the other. Ready to work. Well, anyways. Something you're doing? In order Gana. to support a larger population, additional orc burrows will have to be constructed. Are we gonna burrows just use provide four? the food that allows you to train more troops. To construct a burrow, select one of your peons. Ready to work. You have just placed a rally point for your structure. Yeah. Whenever a unit finishes training from this building, this you one? will automatically travel to the rally point's location. This is the to elder. place a rally point, select one of your unit producing structures and right click on the ground where you want the rally point to appear. Yeah. Yes, that's this one. Set rally point. Bam. Bam. Well placed war mills can increase the efficiency of your lumber harvesters. Try ordering a peon to construct a war mill near where your peons are chopping wood. You know, if I had the gold, I would do it. But I don't have the gold. It'll take some time. A little bit of time. I could cheat. I mean, this is single player. Work, work. No, we no need cheats. More gold. Let's wait for that four, 240. There we go. Work it here. And then work, work. you go Ready work, to work on some lumber. Yes. Well, we are waiting for Grum Hill Scream. Apparently. But from all we know, then he is. Wait, what's this? This is a bridge, isn't it? Is that gonna raise? For all we know, he might just be captured. Oh, there. Ready to work. Of course, I didn't know that. Of course. Um, how many did we need? Um, oh, co only a burrow. Okay, so we didn't need more burrows. Burrows, but we're gonna we're gonna build one anyway, just to get a little more food. Work, work. What I found amazing in Warcraft One was that you actually have to build roads to build structures uh so so like you have you have your great hall here and then you would have roads out from it and then you would have to place your buildings around the roads or they couldn't be placed that's so weird Work complete at, at, at least to me because i am so used to 
be playing this game, Walker Free. War mills contain various upgrades that can be researched to improve your troops. To see what upgrades are available. Yep, we upgrade everything. Okay. You guys, you're really trying to get Ready in there to fast. Work. Be happy we get to. one more. And then Work complete. There's sometimes that the peons just have a little space over like now. But otherwise they just pile up there at the gold mine. But something they doing? Four or five, that's Okey the that the that's the best amount, in my opinion Let's anyway. Get on with it. They For update honor. so much, just from Warcraft 1 to Warcraft 2, in terms of just quality all over. I mean, and especially from Warcraft 2 to Warcraft 3, it's been amazingly updated. I mean, this thing, it was only in 2D. I mean, it's still a little kind of Research 2D, complete. but it is 3D. I mean, you can go down here and look, clo all, all close up. Okay, let's get those grunts. Five grunts. Okay, it's gonna take a little time then. But uh, I, I don't know. I think I'll watching. just let Frawl walk down here. And let him see around. Look around, because I know the enemy will spawn down there. And then I'll have to go over the thing there. Well, you guys just keep on harvesting lumber and gold. Work complete. Yeah, go up and have some lumber. And then we're just gonna train. We need more gold. More gold. Okay. Continue producing grunts there. until you reach your quest requirement. Five. Thank you. At least th this map is a little more. Y you gotta do stuff until he starts talking again. That narrator guy. Research complete. Although now I have nothing more to talk about. Well, how about how how about if I talk to you guys for a while? My life for the whole. Wait, how's your day been? It's great, yeah. Not so great. Well, we need more gold. What can you do? It's not always sunshine and rainbows. Although we w do want that. We need more gold. Unless you're a rainbow hater. Just rainbows. That means it has rained. Usually rainbows just means that you've got My the rain has the just passed and you're moving on to sunny days. So sunshine and rainbows, people. Yes, sir. Let's see the grunts yes. here. They also got that update. The upgrade steel melee weapons and steel armor. That's good. Okay. Let's get on. What with you it. want? You two gotta stand huh? in the front, man. My life. Frawl is not a tank. I don't know. Does he have more HP? No, he doesn't. But he does have, have the hero armor. Heroes take reduced damage from piercing and siege attacks. Yes. Also has a little more armor actually than the grunts. The grunts have more HP. That's good. The special thing about the burrows is that they can take up peons and then afterwards it can shoot. My life for the this, this one, it damages 34 to 41. But it's very slow. Pro probably gets faster once more want? peons enter. Zuxa. I don't remember. Maybe. But anyways, it's always probably best to just put all your peons in if you get attacked. Because then you can hide them all the way instead of just having one. And then the rest will be exposed to danger. Yeah. So, My yeah. Life the, the original plan was to start out and make Warcraft 1 and Warcraft 2 a let's play of that, but I couldn't record it. You so. orcs are in violation of the Alliance Internment Act. We've already captured one of your leaders. If you surrender now, we'll spare your lives. War Chief, they say they've captured one of our leaders. Maybe they're referring to Grom. I hope not. But if they have captured Hellscream, I'll make them regret it. Lok Tarogar! Come, my warriors! We must drive the humans back! 
Oh yeah. We're under attack what do you want? for the horde. Something you doing? Just go and harvest that gold. Come on. And you. Oh, you already killed the captain without me even looking. Good job, guys. That was a little late. Okay, we're going. The wretched humans have been destroyed. Move Thrall and the rest of your forces across the bridge. I'm already Thrall. across the bridge, man. What do you want? What about you? You yes. stopped working as well. Why? Destroy oh. everything for the horde. Dog to Arogar. The rich humans have been destroyed. Okay, I gotta yes. find Grom and rescue him. But mm. on the way, we yes. might as well get rid of those wretched humans. Mm. For honor. The, the pest. Dumb. Curse For upon the honor. land. None What's with survive. these scout towers? They don't do anything. Yeah, I can attack gates. But I can also attack the scout towers. So, are there Your anything? Time has come. It doesn't seem like it. Or they're just standing out right here. I don't think so. There we go. Then it's the gate. Come on. Almost. Yes. There we go. For honor. Okay, there was yes. no one there. No citizens at all. For honor. Well, we'll leave the citizens alive. I don't want to kill civilians, no matter what side you're on. And another grunt. Let's get on. That's with nice. It. Got more soldiers. Yes. Anyways, Dabu. what I thought about was doing a let's mm. play of Warcraft 3, yes. and then after that, mm. I'll go over to StarCraft. Because that interests me as well, but I haven't bought the game. Also, my friend has told me that I could mm. actually. Yes. Um, Look, regard, no I call. could play the StarCraft yes. 1 campaign mm. through. When you control the multiple spellcasters at the same time, it often becomes necessary to quickly switch between them to cast their individual spells. By using the subgroup interface, you can do so without Dabu. having to try to select them individually. Hmm. Yeah. Notice that yes. the currently selected Come units on. are displayed For in the Doom bottom Hammer. middle portion of your screen by little portraits. Yeah, here. One of the unit portraits is highlighted with a yellow glow. This means that it is the currently activated subgroup. You can switch between subgroups by pressing the tab key or left clicking on one of the portraits that is not highlighted. Look, this activates that subgroup and displays their spells in the command ah. Double. Yes. Hmm. Yes. So I wanted to move over to StarCraft, and my friend told me that I could play the StarCraft 1 campaign through the StarCraft 2 game. So pretty much what I need to, needed to do was to go and buy off the game on Battle.net. I am the uh, The Battle.net launcher thing. And then, um, yes. With that. We found where they're holding Grom, but Just the area and, is protected uh, by Fortified Star Guard Towers. Then destroy them! Hellstream must be free! For honor. We got him. We haven't, we haven't lost one of them. Yes. And we're just charging through. And I think we're here. Oh no! is almost dead. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh no. For honor. Next one. Can I? No. You can't use chain lightning on the buildings. That would be stupid if you could anyway. Directly. A wise plan. Let's get on with it. Okay, Dumb. and then the last one. Oh, it's gonna kill my shaman there. How can I hear? I am the watch. Maybe the second one as well? Or will I get the tower first? I got the tower first. Hmm. Yes. For honor. Okay. 
We got it. We rescued Grum. Grum Hill's green. Grum. It's Are purple. You right? I'm fine, little brother. Luckily, they only injured my pride. Great, because we're getting out of here now. We're leaving the human lands for good. Finally. Follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> we can set sail on the humans' own ships. <laughs> Perfect. But we'll need to wait for the rest of the Horde. The Horde is assembled, War Chief. We await only your command. Now, go, young Thrall. Sail west to the lands of Kalimdor. It is there that you will find your destiny. It is there that your people's salvation will be assured. Yes, we're going to Kalimdor. Victory! Alright, and that was the prologue. Exodus of the Horde. Let's just go and see. I don't think it starts over. No, we completed the prophecy that was in the introduction. Then there was Thrall's vision. Uh, we couldn't see those two, sadly, but you can search for them if you'd like to see them on YouTube. Probably, you can find one, find them. I'm sure you can. Then we completed chapter one, ch chasing visions, and chapter two, departures, which was the building base tutorial. So. That's, that was the prologue and the introduction to this Let's Play. So, thank you for watching this episode of Warcraft 3 Reign of Chaos. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.